Hey everyone, Alex Ionescu here. Welcome to Investor's Guide to the Galaxy. When Tesla stock is down, you hate Elon. When Tesla stock is up, you suddenly love Elon. Ross Gerber in video call. Let's dive right into it. Tesla stock price yesterday up 7.39%, year to date down 46%. Ross Gerber from Gerber Kawasaki Fund is on fire today. He talks about investing in stock market and it's funny and true at the same time. Listen to this video cut from a video call between Farzad Mesbahi, ex-Tesla employee, Alexandra Mertz, Gary Black and Ross Gerber. I say this all the time. Everybody's attitude is 100% related to whether they're making money or losing money. And it's like, oh, everybody's down because Tesla's down. If Tesla's rallying, everybody thinks this is the greatest thing ever. It's just, you know, this is the thing that bothers me at my firm too. Everybody starts complaining how much they hate Elon, you know, when the stock's down and then when the stock's up, how much they love him and what a genius he is. And I'm like, you know, you can't make these judgments based off your portfolio value every day. That's a fair point, Ross. I agree with you. I agree with you. If we were in a, if we were in a bull market, it wouldn't be the semantic criticism. He, he would still be underperforming because the market would be up and he wouldn't be up as much. Just like the last, you know, couple of days or last week, market's actually been up. Not today, obviously. And Elon's lagged it, but but you're right. If, if if he was flat to slightly up, we wouldn't be criticizing. That's true. You know, perception, I say this all the time. Perception is everything. You know, reality is a sort of broad term that we use, but we all have a different perception of the same thing. And how our perceptions are colored by stock prices and money is often much, much more than we realize. And just like who the hell would sell Tesla today at 178? You know, like, I don't know, like, what else would I buy? You know, like, mm -hmm. am I going to buy Apple? That's certainly not the way to wealth compared to Tesla, you know? And so it's like, this is what I tell people in my portfolio. I got 5% in Apple. I got 5% in Microsoft. Okay. Safe, boring, straightforward businesses with managers that will never be in the media for anything other than saying positive things towards gay rights or whatever. Okay. And then you've got Tesla as the other 10% of my portfolio, where you got a CEO who literally pisses off everybody in the world. So you get both with me. You get 10% is super safe and boring tech. They're not going to piss anybody off. And 10% might make you real unhappy, but it's the innovator of our time. That's investing. I'd like to know your opinion on this. Please leave a comment below. If you like this video, please smash that like button so that other people like you see this video. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. I appreciate all of you that watch my videos. See you next time.